how do I pack my natural hair? I've had that line on several occasions. In this video, I'll be showing you simple pack cargo style that you can use every time and you look classic and chic and it, this is not going to cost you anything and it's just like I say, less stressful. So I'll be showing you four different type of style that you can use and pack on your hair and you look still look classic. So now let's start by style one. This simple style, all what you need is just give it your pattern. Whatever pattern you love to look, just give it that part. It can be side, it may be whatever, it may be center. But well, I love this very side right arm pattern. Or you can even put your left arm pattern and just go ahead. And please do not forget to like this video, subscribe, and make sure you put on your notification bell so that you always be the first to watch my new video each time I upload a new one. So like I say, this style is just simple, classic anytime, but the pattern makes all the difference. Just make sure you give it your hot classic pattern. The pattern may come down a little bit or hop just like my mine. Just give that hot pattern and you're good to go. And this simple style can go on any form of dressing of the day, even in office, going out in the evening, church service, and you still look classic. So it's just simple pack. All what you just need to do is just make sure your hair is moisturized. You can moisturize your hair with a aloe vera, mix it with clove water, and you'll be just like I did. This is what I applied to my hair before I started. Just put it on my hair like 30 minutes before I started this styling. And your hair will be soft and be able to pack it in whatever pattern you like. Who doesn't like this look? I guess you do. With aloe vera and clove water as your moisturizer and you seal it with any of your favorite oil you're good to go and you're going to get this glam flawless stylish air anytime on the day and when you don't just get your any of your brush and just make it slick and if you like you can tie your hair scarf depending on how stubborn your natural hair can be sometimes our natural hair can be so stubborn so if your hair is the type that always want to stay at the top you can tie your scarf around it and this style will can last you all day i bet you do with the glove and aloe vera it's just going to stay all day and you see how slick it is who doesn't like natural hair yeah natural hair gang here we come so please remember to follow me on my instagram and facebook and most importantly as well please kindly like this video comment share with your friends and family and likewise subscribe and remember to click on your notification bell so you always be the first to watch my video each time i upload a new one so thank you very much as you do so okay now that's enough now let's move on to our next year style so the next step i will be showing you the next step on what i do to achieve my second look for this step so now let's go as i show you the step and guide on how to achieve the second style look if you notice i retain my pattern the only thing i just did i just cut a little bit from the frontal and just leave it so my pattern still remain i only divided a little bit of my hair in the frontal part so that is simple so not this is just going to cost you within two three minutes to five minutes you're done honestly you're going to, you can do this in less than five minutes and you look fabulous with it so all i did is i just twist my hair you can twist it towards left arm or right and the only thing is this may give you a little bit of tactic towards it but depending on how you twist it so sometimes I twist towards left or right, depending on the kind of contour I want the front to look like. So if I twist it towards right and I want to pin it down and I don't like the contour it's giving me, I'll change the twist to the left or right, depending on what I wanted or how I want to look at that particular time. So just make sure you know that how you twist they determine how the contour and the appearance of this front will look like. So this is the kind of look i want on this very one sometimes if i want a little bit more of drama i may change the twist 
of how I twist this. This air is kind of a dramatic air, but I like it. Drama and funky. This look can go on any style, so just make sure you change your look and style with this. Change your look with this simple style to look glam most of the time, and you never get to run out of style or look with your natural hair. You should be able to be proud to put your head out there and say, you know what, I can do a lot of things with my natural hair and I still look pretty with it. We should all embrace our natural hair. And I kind of really, really love this. Yeah. Okay, now let's go as we step on our next style, which is our third style. This pattern, you can use my pattern that I've been using. But because of this video, I'm going to dive a little bit to change the center part, to change the center pattern, just to make sure I, I'm not just using one pattern for all the style. So now, but I really, really love the side pattern to do the style. It look extravagant when I do it. I Really, I love the look, but just like I said, for purpose of this video, I'm going to be using a setup pattern so that I don't just use only one pattern for all the video. So now let's go. As I show you this very, very, very simple style that can still make you look like a million buck. All you have to do is just take start from the root of the frontal hair and just start twisting in it. This you're not matting. You're not doing anything. You're not doing a uh, two wave lock or one. What do they call it? This is just twisting it. This or well, like a baby can actually do as well. Just twist, rolling it as if you're doing a roll. That's just what you're doing on this. You're not matting in any style. So just roll it as you see and it pick every hair in it. It makes your hair lifted. It kind of lifts your face up a little bit. So that is why I love this style. And you do the same on the second part of the hair as well. Please, please, please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel right now. I know you will, so thank you very much for doing that. So once you're done twisting both parts of the hair, while you use the pin to hold the other side, or as you're doing the second part, bring the two, remove the clip, bring the two together and use your chulis yeah my chulis <laughs> to just make sure you knot it together and if the chulis is not going to talk properly uh, like i did on this i used my pin to pin down the chulis edges so that i can get to tuck it in properly Please remember to give me a follow on my social media and you on Instagram and Facebook. Let's connect outside YouTube. So thank you very much as you connect with me on my social medias and So my bobby pin is doing the magic of talking in my chulis edges so it does not just dangling around something like that. Do you like any of the styles so far or is there any particular kind of style you would want me to do of or for your hair style or on your skin type just tell me any video you have want me to do and i will make that video particularly for you so comment below and let me know on the comment section this simple style goes on on everything like i said and the look are classy. This looks make you look classy, glam, any time of the day. Tell me if you have to wear this to a very big event and you're going to look different. No, you're going to be looking 
like a million bay. Yes, this red carpet. Here we go. I know you love this video, but please do me a favor. Please kindly like this video right now, comment, share with friends and family, and remember to subscribe if you're here to subscribe and click on the notification bell so you always get to notify each time I drop a new video. Now let's go to the last tie on this video. This last tie. I so much love it because it's so rocky that it's simple as well. Simple and the rock star style. So you see how it is. Man, you aren't see anything yet. Just wait till you see the finishing touches this style is gonna give to you. You can have this style in a scatter funky like this because I've I have a lot of moisturizer on this, so that's why I'm going to change it into a kind of a dough style normally i normally have to have it scattered like sort of not have it in a dough pack because the dough pack is like when you want to look as pretty classic but when i want to show a little bit of drama i just left it on pack i don't put it in a dough form which i normally do most of the time i just kind of give them drama like and when i do that people kind of aren't you tired of, of going all around with your natural hair why are you terrorizing us and i love it i love it when i do that so now i'm going to do this dough style this dough style is classic anytime any day so this just get a little bit of any of your bow and tie it down or you can use a scarf if you don't have a short bow like this you can use any small scarf to form your style or you have a, a butterfly or pin just give it a little bit of accessory and you're going to look glam with this style so if you're thinking my hair can't do this because i have a hard texture of hair i need to treat my hair or i don't have a long hair i have some bunch of videos on my channel that can give you on how to maintain and treat your hair hair mask how to make your hair oil, even moisturizer to have that look soft here you want and be able to form any of this style. So please do not forget to like this video, comment, let me know where you're watching this video from and please subscribe, click on the notification bell so you always know when I drop any new video. So thank you very much. Please go now to my channel and watch others of my videos. See you.